Hey everyone, Son of Beast and Terry Crews here. This is NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs 24 on EA Sports. Hey everybody, it's Lightbulb here. Welcome to the second part of the game of tonight's coverage of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. This time, we're ready to send you back to Smashville, Tennessee, as we're getting things set here on the board. And we've got a great matchup right in between of the Dallas Stars facing against the Nashville Predators. This one is not always a take if you're all spotting on for QC Soros. But now, for the fourth game, I have another one calling for. It's Lankanen for the fourth, fourth game in the playoffs. And now he's ready to take all of his time, and he will be ready to take all for anybody who wants to get this thing done. It's going to be a tight one here, guys. So are you ready for Smashville and Dallas? I'm always ready. Now for the next commentator. Commentator I will have is James Cervalski along with Cheryl, and Car Andre will be on a center ice. Taking a look at in between of the players with the static of their sorry statistics on that and the goals, and I'll be back here with for the post game show right in between. Let's get cracking. Enjoy the next part of the game in Tennessee of the Smashville Predators against the Dallas Stars. Let's do it. Let's play hockey, James. Get 
going quickly here, and they're up early in the first. That's so important when you're the away team that you don't come out flat. You get your lines into it right now. Well, starts goal. His power play goal is the third season score here by number 24, Pete Pates. His first assistant here by number 20. Mirro, let's go. Driving a goal of the game in the power play. Oh, 245 remaining in the first period. Got the goal by Blue Pigs and Miro Heskinen. 245. Forsberg's coming against the boards. The Stars cross the line and gain the zone. Go a solid check and he loses control of it. Yeah. 
Hey everybody, it's Son of Beast. Hope you enjoyed this part of Smashville game of the NHL, of the Stanley Cup playoffs on EA Sports. But, as you may already just remember it from the first season, this didn't happen to take long than expected to have that one right in between, since they missed the postseason last year as they messed up already and they have been eliminated already for after the final season. But, they have been distorting the things, things right away. They haven't just got their timing run. On their straight advantage of the goal, it doesn't happen to be one of his appearances that happen to be like right in between the Phil Forsberg and UC Soros. This might have been a hard one to take, but nobody had ever know that this one has came out to, to be alive right in between. But as you may already expected it, it does happen to be most of the goal certainties that they're trying to get this one right in between. It's not what they all expected, but as you may have already mentioned before, that Nashville Predators are trying to get their way in there. Since they made it all the way to the finals since 2017, and it was not the only day that they've been really been stepping into, they got their potential way, and they definitely do want to get that one game going. We'll find out if they keep on coming in straight. As you may have already remember this, if you have some tickets here, you might be finding it else with what goes in next, so you'll see on its way soon. And because of that point, you won't stop and you won't quit here with NHL of Nashville team. Smashville, get your games light up and hopefully you can be in the next one here to help and support and be a praise fan. Not to mention move before, but, I, but this is what the team I like for. Don't question me of why do I like the Predators. And that being said, let's kick back into the second period and get started. Back to you James. Son of Beast, out. Picked up along the boards by Jankowski. Takes a shot. Oh, what a clutch 
so impressed in particular in that last sequence, James, and he's out of gas. It didn't prevent him from making that save, but now he's going to get some much needed rest as that puck heads out of his own. Slides into Marchman. Moves it to Boucher. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Nashville's got the puck along the boards. And that's picked up in the defensive end. Good news to the fighter to knock them off the puck. Two minutes for tripping. The Nashville Predators are in penalty kill. Closer to the action, you wind up reaching, you take the feet out of your opponent, you wind up with a tripping ball. They scored earlier on the power play, James, and it was simple, but it was effective. Why? Because they know the personnel, they know the strengths of their team, and guess what? It's all on the blue line and the way they shoot the puck. And it is hard and it is hard. That's what the league get number 27 for a slash eight. The road for triple. So I'm going to go the 203. That's two minutes for a road for the road number 27. So I'm going to go the 203. Dallas Storks. On power Scored here by number 20, by number 95. Matt, 
Christmas has to be my number 21, Jason Robinson, and my number 29, Jay Crawford, Jay Dottinger. Time to go. 1945 remaining in the NBA That's Nash Dashing, along with Jason Robinson and Jay Dottinger, 1945.
The Stars are up 3-1. Dallas takes possession off the draw. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Dallas moves ahead with the puck. They put the puck into the offensive end. Here's a short pass to Yossi. Keeps a hold of the puck after that knock. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Quick feed to Nyquist. Dragged along the boards by Forsberg. Grabs control of it at the point. Nashville's got a hold of the puck. Nyquist started in the offensive zone. Here's a chance. Oh, he got covered by Ottinger. That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, taking away all the ice and make himself as big as possible. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. The Stars start with the puck in their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Serving pass! And that doesn't go because it's off the stick. Into the offensive zone. Quick pass to Trenton. Moves inside! Oh, the outside of the frame! Russ hits the frame again, James. This is all be so frustrating. You gotta say to yourself, man, can I get a bounce? Picked up along the boards by McDonough. And they turn it over in the neutral zone. Up along the wing. 
And now he tries to get it across to Hicks. The Predators have it from their own end. Quick possession along the ball. Dallas gets a hold of the puck against the boards. Knocked away in the offensive zone. Into the corner now. And it's a quick pass to Glass. Oh, right to the front. And that's blocked from someone in front. The Stars get a hold of the puck along the boards. Quick pass to Pavelski. Dallas on the attack. The Predators gain control of it. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. All the praise fans, get home safely. Alright guys, thank you so much. A disappointing effort. The Dallas Stars are making its way towards the first to second round 
we go right down to three stars. Miro Eskinen with just two assists and four hits. He only made that one with that saving ability. Rupens with two goals and five hits. He only gets done that for, for once. He's making his way down towards the side of the net. Got a great offensive skill. And your first star, Jake Ottinger with 46 saves. He's been doing kicking it up like he did. Here's how to do with the total statistics. 47 over 31 for National Predators over Dallas Stars. They didn't really take a lot of time to do this one in there. They're having a lot of difficulty to maintain it. Then it was 38 over 29 hits for Dallas Stars. 1248 over 337 for time on attack of Nashville. An 88 percentage over 76 for Dallas for passing percentage. 23 face-off wins over 17 for Dallas Stars. Four-minute penalty kill was Nashville, and that's two power play goals with 148. They've been doing a lot harder right now. I think the Dallas Stars are a fan favorite team. So they'll be heading back home to play in in Dallas against the Predators one last time. And if the Braves win again, it will happen again with another part of a game as this will be Game 6 back to Smashville as they will be heading their way right towards the other side. And that being said is, thanks for joining us here for today, tonight's game and we've got one more game for you. The Canucks and the Kings at LA. Let's see if the Kings can tie this game up. With that being said, thank you all for tuning in and peace out folks for a while as the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs on the A Sports style. See you all for the final game. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.